All right, Chris Frankie out here at Nellis BMX for King of Vegas round number four out here with Connor Fields. Connor's been out of action for a little while, but he's making his return, hitting the tracks around uh, Southern Nevada, and now he's out here racing King of Vegas with us again tonight. So Connor, you've been out for a little while, so tell us a little bit about what happened and why you were out of racing for a little bit. Um, basically, I have a long-standing issue that I've had for a year or two, and it just got to the point where I couldn't deal with it anymore, and I had to go in and get it fixed, and uh, my knee wasn't tracking in the right, in the right alignment. Like it was supposed to track, you know, smoothly. It was tilted to the side, so it was rubbing on the femur, and I had to go in, and they basically just realigned it. Now, was it an injury that made you finally go in for it, or was it just bugging it you after a, a while? It was a combination of over time, combined with at the Worlds last year and at the Disney Cup, I took two crashes straight onto my knee that aggravated it even more, and I just couldn't handle it anymore. I raced the Grands, but it hurt way too bad, so after the Grands, I got surgery. Gotcha. Now you spent some time with Phantom on track and then you went on to free agent, but now you got some new stuff going on. So tell us a little bit about your new sponsor and the things that they have going on. Um, when the opportunity arose to ride for Christoph Vex, new company, I couldn't really turn that down. You know, he's a living legend and, uh, you know, it's every, everything's great so far. The bike's awesome. Um, whole new, whole new shape and type of bike fits me really good. Uh, all new parts and, uh, Lighter than my old one, stiffer, feels better, fits me better, so it's all good so far. Now I also understand Kristoff has a couple of different labels that he's using. What different labels is he using and what kind of it's, stuff are they uh, making? It's just like with the company VSI owns Intense, Speed, THE, Since, same sort of thing where the company's called BMX Racing Group, it owns Chase, which is the frame, Eleven, which is the bar and forks, uh, and, and they make like head headset stuff and then there is excess which is the wheel company and hub company um, there's insight which makes pads and number plates and kingstar which makes little stuff like a seat post or uh, spacers little 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 trinkets like that gotcha now obviously we're glad to see you on the track again you've been a you know a great representation of southern nevada i would say vegas but you guys are out of henderson so, uh, but still, Southern Nevada, Vegas Valley, you've been representing uh, the area for a long time, very well for us. Um, what kind of things you got going on for the future and what are you working towards? Um, well, I'm excited to be out here today. This is my first time doing any sort of race since uh, the Grand, so I mean, I was, I'm not gonna, I, I'm gonna have probably some butterflies in the gate a little bit, just cause it's been a while. Um, Salt Lake here in a couple weeks, and then World Championships at the end of July in Copenhagen, and then uh, over the next year, be doing all the races, get qualified, and, Try to make the Olympic team. Gotcha. Well, we all wish you the best. All right, Thank you very much for coming out. And again, we're very Ready glad to have you back on the track. Sounds good. All right, Chris Frankie wrapping it up out here at Nellis BMX.